The 1932S Washington Quarter is one of the rarest coins in the Washington Quarter series, with mintage of only 408,000. This low mintage was due to the Great Depression and the low demand for coinage at that time. Today, the 1932S Quarter is highly prized by collectors and can command a high price, particularly in higher grades. This superb gem in Mint State 66 exhibiting lustrous surfaces that gleam beneath delicate patina of russet and pale blue. A rare example with fantastic detail and great eye appeal which ended up selling for $45,500 at David Lawrence auction. Moving on with this 1964 proof Kennedy of dollars, a popular accented hair variety, type 1. Graded as PR68 by PCGS, comes with deep cameo designation, which means this coin features stark contrast between frosty reliefs and mirror-like fields. Of the over 3.9 million proofs that the Philadelphia Mint struck for the first year 1964 Kennedy of dollar, Rick Tamaska estimates that only about 100,000 coins are of accented hair variety. The easiest way to differentiate between the type 1 and type 2 designs is to look at the hair strands directly above Kennedy's ear. On the accented hair variety, two prominent strands in the area form V-shape. That's not seen on the type 2 examples. Additionally, the type 1 variety has a weak or broken lower left serif on the letter I in the Liberty, as well as slight pitting and rounded edge in the shield on the eagle's breast on reverse. Scarce in an absolute sense, the Type 1 accented hair is particularly challenging to locate in gem and higher grades due to prevalence of hair lines and milky spots on surviving examples. The value of this gem was realized at $12,000 at Stax Powers auction. Next, this wheat penny dated 1931, CAC approved registry candidate, graded in mean state 67 read by PCGS. The 1931 Lincoln set is scarce in MS67 red, but CAC endorsement really sets this coin apart from its peers, ranking it among the finest examples of the date available. Satiny copper red luster complements both devices, and neither side has notable abrasions. Some dye erosion is evident in the reverse margins as usual. This highly elusive scent fetched the sum of $4,200 upon sale at Heritage Auctions. This is 2005 P. Jefferson Nickel with American Bison Reverse, elusive satin finish variety, absolute numismatic gem with visible contact marks equaling to none. Great as SP70 by PCGS, the satin finish is special treatment that gives the coin a muted, brushed appearance that's different from typical shiny finish. Believe it or not, the price of this coin reached $4,726.12 with buyer's fee at Great Collections Auction. This is an error 1956 Franklin half dollar struck on a silver quarter planchette, graded in mint state 65 by PCGS. Brilliant! Gem quality wrong planchette error showing frosty luster and sharp strike. Most of Liberty is off the flam as well as the most of United States of America. The date is intact and half dollar is readable. It was sold for $3,120 at Heritage Auctions. And here is 1959D Lincoln cent with triple punch mint mark. The 1959DDD cent is a rare variety of Lincoln cent that features three distinct mint mark impressions on the coin. The mint mark D for the Denver mint is stamped on the coin three times, creating a noticeable tripling effect. This variety is highly sought after by collectors, and it is considered to be one of the most significant dye varieties in the Lincoln Sense series. The triple D variety is particularly valuable in higher grades such as Mint State 65 or a higher. This gem in MS66 red condition was sold for $1103.12 with buyer's fee at Great Collections Auction. Thanks for watching guys, don't forget to hit like and subscribe buttons. Have a nice